Hey everybody, Wiselwook here. In this video, we're going to look at all the changes being made to Game Pass from October 15th up until October 30th. That's including all the new games coming to the PC, console and Android, as well as the games that are leaving the service. So if you are close to finishing them, you know what date you need to finish them by. If you enjoyed the video and find the information useful, consider liking and subscribing to see more. And also leave a comment below, which of these games are you going to be playing? Mo looking forward to playing most, if any? And also, what other games are you looking forward to coming to Game Pass in the future, be it a new release or a rumoured appearance? But for now, let's jump right in. The first game coming to the PC version of Game Pass on October 15th is Age of Empires 3 Definitive Edition. Age of Empires 3 Definitive Edition completes the celebration of one of the most beloved real-time strategy franchises in definitive form. Command mighty civilizations from across Europe and the Americas or jump to the battlefields of Asia in stunning 4K Ultra HD graphics with a fully remastered soundtrack. Experience two new game modes including all previously released expansions and 14 civilizations plus two brand new civilizations, the Swedes and Inca. Return to adventure for this final chapter of the Age of Empires Definitive Edition journey. The next game, also coming to the PC on October the 15th, is Heave Ho. Grab one another's hands, climb across dangling bodies, and swing your pals to safety in a wobbly, dangly mess of limbs. Heave Ho tasks up to four players with a simple goal, don't fall to your death. Players will use their own two hands and the outstretched grip of their friends to grapple across each level on their way to victory. Customise your character with stylish accessories in a vain attempt to remember which of your hands is the only thing between you and the plummet of doom. The next game, coming to Android console and PC on October the 15th, is Katana Zero. A stylish neo-noir action platformer featuring breakneck action and instant death combat, slash dash and manipulate time to unravel your past in a beautifully brutal acrobatic display. Each level is uniquely designed for countless methods of completion. Defeat foes creatively using spontaneous approaches to eliminate your enemy as you see fit. The next game coming to console and PC on the 15th is Tales of Vesperia Definitive Edition. The fate of two friends will collide in an epic journey that threatens the existence of the world in Tales of Vesperia Definitive Edition. A powerful struggle begins with a civilization dependent on an ancient technology, the Blastia, and the empire that controls it. Relive the most beloved Tales of Tile, beautifully remastered in HD with new playable characters, new stories, and more special attacks. The next game, coming to PC on the 15th, is The Swords of Ditto, Mormor's Curse. A compact action RPG that creates a unique adventure for each new hero of legend in this relentless fight against the evil Mormor. Explore a delightful but dangerous overworld, brave menacing dungeons and improve your hero in a charming village. During your quest to overcome the evil that plagues the island, grab a core friend for an unforgettable adventure filled with delightful characters, extraordinary loot and heroic battles. The next game, coming to console on October the 21st, is Scourgebringer. From the developers of Neurovoider, Scourgebringer is a fast-paced, free-moving roguelike platformer, much like a crossbreed between Dead Cells and Celeste. Set in a post-apocalyptic world where a mysterious entity wreaked havoc on all humanity, Scourgebringer puts you in the shoes of the deadliest warrior of her clan, Kyra. Help her explore the unknown and slash her way through ancient machines guarding the seal of her past, and maybe the redemption of humanity. The next game, come to console on October 22nd, is Cricket 19. The official game of the 2019 Ashes Championship is the complete cricket simulation, featuring a suite of exciting all new features that add even greater depth and rich new content to the Big Ant Studios acclaimed cricket engine. Tackle historical scenarios for classic matches through the ages, develop the career of a junior right through to national captaincy, participate in the fully licensed Ashes cricket mode, or lead your nation to the greatest world championship in the classic 50 over one day mode. The final game coming to console on October the 22nd is Superland. 
save the red stick figure village in this hit first person open world action puzzle platformer roam and explore a grand interconnected world unlock the versatile abilities and combine them to overcome imaginative puzzles or uncover shrouded secrets defeat charging hordes in fast friendly first person combat as you battle your way for an audience with the blue king Superland is the ultimate sandbox adventure game and offers players of all ages a unique take on puzzles, exploration and adventure. So that's it. That's all the games coming to Game Pass this for the rest of this month. So that's the 15th up to the 22nd there. Now, there's some games leaving Game Pass in this up until the 30th and they're leaving in two sections. So on the 15th, Felix the Reaper is leaving console and PC. Metro 2033 Redux is leaving console and PC. Minute is leaving console and PC. Saint Throw the Fourth Reelected is leaving PC. And State of Mind is also leaving PC. Then on October the 30th, After Party is leaving console. Lego Star Wars 3 is leaving console. Rise and Shine is leaving console. Tacoma is leaving console and PC. The Lord of the Rings Adventure Card Game is leaving console and PC. And the Red Strings Club is leaving PC. And that's it. That's all the changes that are being made to Game Pass from the 15th to the 30th. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, say like and subscribe to see more. And also leave a comment about what you think about the games that are coming. Have you been playing any of the ones that are leaving? And what did you enjoy them? Hope you enjoyed the video. Wookie out.